Today we are going to clean the Jeep Grand Cherokee mass airflow sensor and the throttle body. All we need a 2-in-1 package from Walmart, the CRC, CRC brand, around $8 to $10, and one small flathead uh, screwdriver along with uh, one cleaning cloth or tissue paper or the kitchen wipes, it's gonna work. So we can open the, it's very simple, open the hood and then remove the cover. This cover requires four spots to be pull over. Then use a screwdriver and open the clip off from the throttle body older model they have that throttle body is actually way behind but this model is a 3.6 liter jeep grand Cherokee limited this is a sensor connector remove it and then open the screw from the screw head from the air filter Don't be scared, it's very strong. Then push it from the, this area and from the top because there's two clips. And remove this cable clip by putting upside down. Use a screwdriver or anything that you can push this cable out. Push it, take it out, oh man, this is so dirty, shoo, super duper dirty. I took a little bit of tissue paper and a plastic bag and put it inside in a plastic bag, the tissue paper or the kitchen paper and put it inside if uh, and put it inside if i spray it so the debris not gonna go inside in the engine bay even if it fell down inside it's not uh, uh don't worry about it because when you will start the engine the all the dirt and everything will go away by burning by the pistons so these two you need a little bit on the cloth and inside when I opened this thing I was so surprised it was very clean uh, very dirty takes more than 20 not more than 20 minutes the you must clean this one every 15 to 15 between 15 thousand and 20 thousand miles I did it with my Toyota 4Runner and after and when I clean it up I actually forgot and I was surprised I was getting little two mileage 4Runner is pretty bad in the mileage and I was getting 20 miles, 21 miles per, per gallon on the highway with the speed of the 70 miles per hour. So then I figured out, oh, because I cleaned the throttle body, that's why. So if you want your car to give you little one or two miles extra, this is must to clean it and it's not too difficult. Man, this is too dirty. After when I clean it with the tissue paper, I figure out it's, it was very dirty, so I took a towel and I start cleaning with the towel. On this stage, I remove the plastic bag because I want to clean the whole this area. Because when you do 
Still freaking dirty. Sensor is actually sensor inside of the pipe, so it's no need to remove it, just spray on the top of the sensor. It's not recommended to touch it. it. That's the sensor, just remove it. That's, I believe, is a mass fair uh, flow sensor. There's one <coughs> other sensor, but I'm not sure that's the sensor as well. There's no information available on the internet. So plug this uh, connector and plug this clip. It up. And on the top there is one hook no. and on the, where this clip I am putting underneath there is one another uh, hook for yeah. this whole, uh, whole thing. Oh. On one stage I have figured out that the throttle way. body area, the clip was not open all the way so I opened it and oh, then pushed it and it. when it went all the way then I tied it up. Put these two first. So when you start the car, it's gonna take, uh, it's gonna wobble, miss, uh, miss fire. Like it's gonna wobble. Let's see what happens. See, for some setting, uh, fun, uh, for a few seconds. So leave the car as, as it is for five minutes. The computer will program itself automatically. So this is the thing. This is ladies and gentlemen. This is all about clean the throttle body and get a good mileage of your car. Leave the car for five, 10 minutes. That's it. <laughs> 